All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to be talking about how to attack cafe. Um, so, we're going to go third floor kitchen, second floor. Basically, I like playing... Hmm. Usually, I'll play gridlock for third floor because she's cracked, to be completely honest. She's very good. There's lots of... There's not a lot, actually, of... Um, places you need to tracks but it's still good to have so i'll like have my drone back out at the spawn i spawn usually christmas market which i like to spawn at just because you can get spawn peaked but it's kind of difficult to be spawn peaked from um but anyway just kind of watch these windows watch these windows and then you're fine uh anyways back on to back on track the first thing I'll do is I'll go up to the roof because I have the super shorty and okay what a lot of people do is they'll repel upside down on this subject on this map because there's so many windows but anyways I'll take the super shorty crack open these hatches which is good just kind of get that open get that going somebody might be playing there and then I'll just kind of quickly check them see if anybody's under them really fast see if that's reinforced and then I'll tracks red stairs so we can't really get flanked from there. Um, and then I might move over to skylight and just kind of see what's happening over here. See if anybody's rotating. Check freezer door, freezer door around the bar. And then I'm not going to sit there for too long. And then I'll rotate back this way. I usually like to drop new hatch. Uh, kind of drone this out, drone everything out. And I'll drop right here. Shoot the default cam kind of be watching all of this and lots of people go for this wall so we're just going to open this really quick usually with a thermite obviously because teams will usually reinforce this because once you're in here you kind of cut this is a big spot to roam in or to hold and then if you have new hatch and you have piano you have literally half of for uh, half of third floor and then just kind of tracks the back stairs of those move along maybe get freezer wall or this wall if you place a thermite charge here you should be able to get a little bit of this wall and then mainly this wall because then once you get this wall you can push in and if if you have a habana as well you just kind of push in right here if you have freezer open and then you can plant right here this is really safe because this is stone and this is also indestructible as well uh so this is a safe spot to plant. You have somebody in new hatch watching there. Open up this wall, watching all of this. Piano watching there. Basically, the thing with attacking, and on, especially with gridlock, you don't need to worry about roamers too much because for them to come up these stairs, they're going to need to make a lot of noise, whether it's either shooting them, which even if they have a suppressed gun, you still hear them, or impacting them. And... There's only a f like two ways to get up onto third floor, are the uh, the, stu the two staircases. So if you have a nomad as well, it's gonna be very difficult for them to come upstairs. Like this, gotta break those three, break all of these, come up, and then you know where they are. They're coming from. Um, or another way thing you can do is you can go over to here, repel on these windows kind of take heaven control the one thing is though you gotta watch out i really overthrew that you gotta watch out for this door out here yeah you gotta watch out for this door because they can easily run out of this and get you while you're on repel so just watch out for that oh look at that um but yeah basically that's about it for attacking third floor the roamer is not that big of a problem just simply because of how little way how little ways there are to get into the site you can even maybe shoot shoot this open i don't know whatever you want but basically get open the hatches is the main thing you want to do open the hatches and then kind of just move through take piano okay uh second site we're gonna be talking about is oh i have shotgun that's actually fine is um attacking kitchen so kitchen is big about vertical gameplay 
realistically most sites are in the game unless it's on the top floor even then you can still play vertically but from downstairs to upstairs um but i'll usually spawn here just because i like spawning christmas market insane uh smg 11 gameplay but anyways like i said in my i had to defend this map there always could be somebody on a shield in this in that right here so you're gonna want to in bakery god i'm like slow you want to burn the ads and then nade it i very poorly cooked that i've actually never noticed that but anyways um like i said this site a lot of vertical gameplay you're gonna want to probably open up this whole area just because people might people usually sit back here watch watch this area over also back here as well because people sit back here i know i sit back here a lot if i'm playing valkyrie kind of prone back here and then oh they're pushing kind of swing out as if you're hard breaching you're going to want to open up this wall a good amount because with this wall you can get into sight obviously and then you can plant back here and this is a good spot to plant like right here because this is indestructible if you have somebody above the site i'm pretty sure this is concrete up here yeah that's concrete but if you have somebody just around this area that then they can't push through the doorway if you just have this whole area opened up which is good and if you're planting there you have this wall open you have somebody watching maybe a rotate hole that's right there um that's pretty much it honestly it's a pretty basic site to attack of course there's obviously going to be some complications depending on what the enemy team does but there's basically two different ways you can attack it you can attack it from bakery or you can go for a freezer or both and you just open freezer you're trying to push everybody in like pinch everybody off um you're just gonna want to roam clear probably go if you're playing somebody like sledge go top to bottom make sure nobody's up here this is a pretty cl quick area to uh clear just because it's pretty open but you're gonna want to definitely clear there drop down here and then inside mining is where you can open all of this up this is where the door would be right here and right here she sludge this be easier right here see just by sludging once i can see a good amount of everything like right here sludge right there i can watch the whole doorway uh but yeah i'm actually just need to be quicker to rotate through yeah you could do something like this even where you sludge this and you can pretty much just sit right here watch there watch there if they're planting you can open up right here make sure that planter is covered pretty much open whatever you think you need to open up right here watch the breach if you if they're banditing open up right here you can get the bandit it's basic vertical gameplay to be completely honest just open up what you think you need to right here if there's a smoke playing on a shield you can just open this up and nade that open up whatever you want realistically you can open up the whole upstairs and it won't matter just try and open up as many lines of sight as you can is pretty good in my opinion just open up all this <laughs> so yeah because that way you can just get the wall you can watch the rotate you can watch the plant you can get the freezer even if you just open this up and get the bandits and then if you get the hatch and the wall then you have control of freezer you can clear this have somebody helping from upstairs to make sure it's all safe and you just push in plant like i said usually you might want to plant right here and then when it comes to watching this hallway this is all concrete no actually it's not wow okay well then even then you just open up all of this this whole area just watch this whole hallway and your team is literally safe to plant to do anything so yeah vertical gameplay very strong attacking this objective okay last objective we're gonna be talking about is attacking reading again vertical gameplay very strong i'm gonna play sledge again um so yeah sledge again strong any vertical gameplay zofia ash buck uh what i would prefer to do is this was this? did they actually go to the right objective yeah i actually think they went reading no no i don't think they did actually never mind um but for this site 
you're gonna want to go it's basically again like kitchen vertical gameplay a bunch i say that a lot but just because that's what it is i would personally go up this way hit the rappel it's basically like you're attacking third floor is what this is gonna be that's a good way to think about it for a lot of stuff it's like you're attacking the floor above it like for this you open up the hatches drone it all out you come through make sure nobody's piano clear this out keep going maybe get this hatch because there's probably gonna be people up here roaming around get control of this you can even make a rotate through to here start sludging all this open because this is the reading room objective boom already have the door open sludge in this corner over here watching around this pillar in the vase over to here around the door just kind of sledging bucking everything open and then that's basically all you need to do for this side you push everybody out get this hatch drop down get this wall and you're just kind of cruising right through now there's no way they can really play safely of course it's not going to be this easy just walking around sledging everything they're probably going to contest you know maybe it's a smoke player and they're right here you can try and contest shoot that basically and then they're gonna have this open because as you can see he actually does as you can see if you open this up they can watch the whole site just from reading okay and that's about it honestly this map is pretty straightforward in my opinion it's a lot of vertical gameplay i keep on saying that a stupid amount because that's what it is it's just get above and then you can uh, control what's below because you saw i just simply opened up a few holes here maybe like one hole there one hole there one hole there and you can just control the whole site you have both entrances into the site and you have an indestructible area to sit and to like toss smokes into the other site from so yeah that's basically it in my opinion for this video uh thank you for watching if you enjoyed make sure you subscribe like comment all that good stuff i stream every day link in description updates about video streams my insane personal life um on my twitter link in the description below thank you for watching and as always peace out